girl Marissa. Thank you so much for tuning into my channel. If you click this video, that means you are officially doing you. So welcome to the doing you club. Now that we're doing us, we need that doing glow, baby, okay? So, first thing is here, if we're doing us, that means we got time. That means we got time to focus on ourselves, do what we need to do. So the first step to doing us and getting that doing me glow is gonna be washing our face every single night. I know, I get it. I have my nights too, I forget too. It could be a lot, but that's all we're doing us. We're focusing on us, so we got the time, baby, okay? So we're gonna make sure we wash every night and then every morning, so let's get started. Um, I'm gonna show you guys my nighttime routine because they say that at nighttime your skin is actually repairing, so that's just really just the most important time to take care of your skin. So if you're gonna take care of it, please make sure you do it at nighttime before anything. If you have makeup on, you're gonna start off with. My favorite is Garnier Skin Active Micellular Cleansing Water all in one. Removes makeup, cleanses, soothes. It's not harsh, it's for all skin types, and I get sensitive skin one too, so. It's amazing, I swear. This is the best thing ever to take off your makeup. I really hate makeup remover wipes. This is the key. Yes, ma'am. The first step to the doing the glow baby is to make sure we're washing every single day and every single night. So we're gonna start off with just a facial cleanser. I have this cleanser called Cleanzar, but just find you a good cleanser that you like. My skin is sensitive, so I can't just use any cleanser. Next is what you're cleansing with. I have two different ones. I got this brush from Vanity Planet. It comes in a really, really, really cute little packaging here. It has three brush head options. It's a silicone one, which is my favorite, and also two just like bristle brush heads. And then I also have another one from, I have to look up the name of this one, but I actually got this on TV. I saw this on TV, y'all. I was like, I gotta try it. It took about a month to come, but it was it's cool. I like this one too, but I definitely will say I use my Vanity Planet one right now. So we're gonna use this, only use this three times a week. Don't overdo it. In the meantime, when you aren't using this, these are the truth, okay? These are on Amazon. Get you a pack, it lasts a good, few months, um, these tiny little pads. I got inspired from going to the facial people, okay? It looks like this. And at first you're like, what the is this? But then it turns into a sponge, like, this is amazing. This is my favorite, like, face hack right now because it's so convenient. And I just use this every single day. I hate washing my face with my hands and I really hate wasting washcloths. But we're gonna use the brush today so we can get that deep clean. Best part. Okay, so once we cleanse the face, um, if you're like super dirty or you haven't exfoliated in a minute, I would suggest using an exfoliator. It's gonna really help with the texture, the dry patches, all of that. So I have a face scrub that I actually got from my facial lady as well. <laughs> Shout out to Rebecca. <laughs> so I love this product. It's not too big. Some of them are just a little too beady for me. But this one's like very fine graded, but not so fine to where I feel like it's not doing nothing. So I actually use my hands for this one. I know it's like all that junk, but I use my hands for this one. You can actually use your brush too. With my hands. It's very, very like fine. So it's giving me like a really good scrub without actually like tearing up my skin. Cause some beads are just too big and I feel like they can be a little rough. So I prefer something that's just a little bit more fine. And I actually like that this one gets a little soapy too. So you can go to like Sephora, Ulta, or even ask your own facial lady if they recommend any scrubs for your skin as well. So now we have our clean surface because that is step one clean skin. I'm not gonna do it today, but normally, like if I'm having a day where my skin just isn't really happy and I have like stuff underneath, I like to go through and use this little toolkit that I bought. I actually got this off of Amazon. Super cute, it's super official, okay? Be careful with this kit, because you can 
Fuck your face up. We don't want to do that. So I usually just take this one and you'll just kind of go through, get whatever like blackheads you might want to get around your nose. If you have any like bumps underneath, you'll just kind of go through and get them out. And it does a really clean job of cleaning it out without you going in with your fingernails because your fingernails can really just like mess up your face and it won't feel right. So I recommend, if you're a picker like me, I definitely like recommend getting one of these. This is personally one of my top favorite products. Um, this is from Glossier. It's called Solution Exfoliating Skin Perfector. This is my favorite like thing to put on to really prevent acne. Um, just keeps my skin like clear, honestly. <laughs> just clear, baby, clear. And we like clear. When we're doing me, we need that cotton swab. all the acne is going to dry it out because it has salicylic acid in it. If you're like me, I have um, acne prone skin. So if I do not take care of my skin, I will break out. Honestly, the right products are just super important to getting that clear skin. I don't mask every night. Um, this is something I would just do occasionally. But like I said, if you are having one of those days where you just want to give yourself like a refresher or your skin's just like been acting up, um, I would recommend this charcoal clay mask. This is from Nola Skin Essentials. Love this. Like, it is my go-to mask because if we open up any of those bumps, we really just want to make sure we are drying them out so they won't give us no more problems. Okay? This mask does tingle a little bit, so I will warn you now. So when you put it on. What is going on? Why does my face feel like it's low key burning? And it's a good thing. It needs to start being. Okay, we got this on. We're gonna let this sit for like 15 minutes. Go read your book. Go drink. Coffee, go say your daily affirmation. Well, actually, this is the evening time, so go say your evening affirmation. Well, yeah, I get two minutes to see. Okay, so we finished the mask. Um, my face is like super tight, feeling it feels really good. If you want to take it up a notch and really give yourself like that glow, like skin, no blemishes, especially after you go in and like really like clean out your skin. I will use this new product that I just I just got put onto this product. It's from Neutrogena, a light therapy mask. It's so freaking cool. So you're just gonna put it on like this, and then you would just hit this little button here. Yes. And it sits on your face for 10 minutes. And I swear to you, if you extract and you do this, it's like flat surface. And then after I did this as well, I feel like my pores were smaller. I feel like my face was even tighter, so I definitely recommend. So we're on our last few steps. I know it seems extreme, I get it. But if we want that doing the glow, it just doesn't happen overnight and you don't get to just glow without doing nothing, okay? You gotta put in that time, you gotta focus on yourself. And that's what we're doing here, we're showing ourselves some tender, loving care, baby, okay? I would go through and do a toner. Tonight I'm going to do the Cream Skin Mist by Laneige. Love this, it feels amazing. Right. Now all of that like my face was just like real like dry and tight feeling after the bath. So this is just gonna give you that moisture back and just give you that glow again. So one of my other favorite products to do to actually keep your skin really like even and give you that glow as well would be vitamin C. I got these little tablets from my facial lady. I have another vitamin C serum that I have from NOLA as well, NOLA Skin Essentials. This one is amazing as well. So I'll just go through, get my vitamin C serum. On my hands. Put it in real good. Up, 
This right here, this is my baby, okay? I just got this maybe like three months ago and it's one of my favorite purchases ever. It's Murad Vitamin C Glycolic Brightening Serum. This, like I said, if you go through and you extract and you're a picker, I hate waiting for acne scar to heal. I feel like that is the worst part of just acne in general because once you get the acne, that's one thing, but then once the scars, you gotta wait weeks and weeks to get rid of that, and then once, by the time you get rid of that, you got another bump, then you gotta start back over again, and it's just like, sis, this is gonna be your best friend, and it's gonna save you time, okay? And I actually have a few scars right here that I've been working on. Right you just let that sit overnight. I will say this does ride as well, so don't be like shocked or alarmed. But it's just like a little tingle. It's not too bad. Then, our last product of the evening. Okay. You want to finish off with a night cream. Just find a night cream that suits your skin very well because you are going to be sleeping in this and you don't want to break out. So make sure you get you a good night cream. This is one of my new faves as well. It's by Laneige. It's called Sleeping Care Water Sleeping Mask. I'm telling you, doing me glow, this, this right here is going to give us that glow that we are looking for. Okay, so now we have the skin already glowing here. And if you really just want to top it all off, go with the eye cream. Murad, they got some products, okay? This eye cream, you guys, works wonders. It's great for dark spots and eyes. They just make you look less tired. Alrighty. That's it, you guys. And this is how you get the doing me glow. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope you guys got some nice tips. I hope you guys enjoyed some of the products that I use. Comment below how you feel. I want to know how you're doing you, how you decide to do you, and get that doing me glow.